here we are today so the tank that we built yesterday this is it on the floor now and we've actually got the dividers in now and there has been a bit of a pain in the backside now you see a couple of different things which is more challenging in this environment one's the heat during the daytime and I think we're going to have cold temperatures in the winter time all actually challenges just to enjoy so we're getting the baffles putting in the dividers and as you can see we're about an inch under but originally they were level with the top so what we've got to do I'll leave them hard at work again today is all of these dividers we need to take just an inch off every single one so that's 120 pieces to cut uh, what else have we got? We've got the finishes, so you can kind of see. This is another tank that we'll quickly knock together. Gives you some idea of the size. Well, I haven't got any dividers in this one yet. But that is one of the finishes that we could go for, which is a nice chrome effect. Very difficult to see under these light conditions. Oh, we've got your typical tank connector just there. So I think we'll be going for the chrome one, because it goes in. We've also had the wall finished off now and we've got the counter in place we've got a filter underneath that bank we've got a filter underneath that bank still just little fiddly bits that we're on doing at the moment so what we're going to do now is we're going to try and do this work so here's some dividers on the table and all we're going to do is we're going to take an inch off an inch off the height of one so i'm going to get lean to hold the camera and I'm going to show you how to cut a piece of glass. The glass cutter that we're using, I actually ordered this one. It is from Japan and I think it's called a Tokyo. It's called a Toyo. Let's just have a look. Very difficult to see there. It is a Toyo made in Japan glass cutter for 4, 6, and 8 milli glass. Pass the camera to Liam. Here we go, Liam. Thank you. So, what we're going to do. We're going to measure just an inch off the edge of the glass, a little tiny dot like so. Get the straight edge, just make sure it's on the straight edge. Somewhere there should be a little blue bookies pen as well. Just love this place, everything goes missing. A pencil that will do us for now, hopefully that will do. I that will crush. So, what we'll do is we'll mark up where the glass cut is going and we just score the glass shove the pencil under the end and hopefully with a little bit of luck so we've taken the taken the edge off there so now that needs sanding and that needs sanding which is what's keeping Liam very very busy and occupied thank you Liam so it's going to be bank holiday weekend now um, hopefully by the time I get this on and then next week we've got all the other glass coming in to make all of the other tanks would like to give you a tour of the place because just outside here let's just go for a little little wonder see you soon Liam bye bye ah. let's take a little look around the place we've just had a delivery of more plants coming in this greenhouse that you can see here is actually a zoo so one day we will go for a wander into the zoo but what I will show you is just quickly a couple of birds of prey just try to find that one's hiding in bed a clean Got another one just here stretching his wings Let's see if we can get a there we go on that hello there we go oh he thinks he's getting fed no food for you today buddy lad there we go 
sure. You know what kind of bird he is? Stick it in the comments below. Uh, very entertaining. This isn't part of the zoo, this is just a few birds of prey that they have on site. And down in the bottom car park, there is actually a golden eagle, which we'll take a look at as well. Maybe in one of the future videos that we've got coming. In there, we have a nice big owl. There we go. This one, another sort of falcon. Again, I'm not sure what type. Some of my favourites up here are the eagle owls, which is going to be difficult to see. But what we'll do is in a future video, is we'll get a hold of Goff and we'll get some close ups and hopefully some of them flying. So, just another part of the site. Again, lots of birds of prey. If ever you come down and you want to see them. Incredible place to come and visit. Don't know if the video is picking everything up. Um, maybe better to come back at feeding time. But anyway, I suppose we better go back. And get 100 pieces of glass cut. Cheers. See you soon.